all right hi collective welcome to the channel this is going to be a tarot reading for august and for virgos okay so we're now in virgo season so this can resonate with anyone really because we're all feeling this virgo energy but strongest with virgo placements or if you're just connected to me and you watch you know me a lot right or guided in me you know energetic match right take whatever you feel is for you any part that's not fitting leave it out okay let's get the night here okay messages for the highest good of all for Virgo okay so a cycle is closing out within a family ten of cups and judgment you see the timer going off like there's definitely judgment being called on a family situation okay see this cycle's closing out i feel virgo like um i mean i just heard enough's enough let it cool so nine of cups energy like i feel that you're in this energy okay you were in this nine of cups energy and I felt it wasn't fulfilling enough for you. So that's why I felt like you're going after your 10th cup of love. And, and like it could look different for you. There's some sort of collaboration here with the three of pentacles. You know. Um, let's find out more. More for Virgo. Yeah. So the three of pentacles came right back out. And so did the nine of pentacles. I feel you came up with the plan, Virgo, and it caused an ending for you. Like, you decided to go off on some sort of collaboration, you know, some sort of movement picking up there with the van. Um, yeah, you, you had choices, and if you feel as though you haven't made choices, because like, it is on the bottom of the deck, that's what's coming. For some of you, like, you're going to have these choices to be able to make these decisions. Look at that Leo energy here. Strength, courage, confidence. I feel that, that you got a lot of that during this last Leo season, which may have caused some sort of walking away, you taking authority and action over your own life with the Emperor energy here. Or this is you walking away going after this Emperor. <laughs> this balance, right? Because there is a celebration and there is something with threes here, right? With three of cups, um three of pentacles three three i was saying in that reading earlier some of you are on the 33rd um timeline blueprint so look i just pulled out ace of cups whatever this is this is like it's like love and money because it's pentacles cups it's just it's so beautiful like you planted seeds and now they're blooming and blossoming here okay ten of wands like you did the work like all those burdens there but look they're they're magical and it's like each of those wands you know are are cloaked in um like you've done something with the world card here you're definitely closing out a situation strategy was required queen of swords like action but that's what i feel like you either did or you're starting to in this virgo season and no all my readings are timeless so i mean over the next couple weeks but if you like to catch them in real time subscribe um king of pentacles so there's this energy surrounding you a work opportunity eight of pentacles to get you out of the five for some of you like you're coming out of a period of time where maybe we weren't working or money wasn't good enough or something like that or just this lifestyle because i'm getting this big this mix right king of swords see there's there's choices there's strategy here king of swords king of pentacles the knight of wands yeah there's a lot of choices here for sure but there's definitely an ending to situation with the five of cups all right virgo it's destiny and six of cups or some of you you have got like a destined connection past life or from the past that's coming back around that's part of your future <laughs> the devil is here Ooh. okay what's coming back around um 
The devil's definitely going to come try to get in the way of or cause some problems. But that tests them, right? Um, or there was some sort of influence. Maybe something already veered you off path and that's what you're walking away from. Definitely some sort of soul connection here with the lovers and the Ace of Wands. Let me break it down a little bit. Tell me about this wheel and the devil. Temperance. See, the devil's coming in trying to tempt you away from this wheel of fortune. It came out serious. It's What's flipped? The three of wands. So uh, there's like a test off at the distance, like often with the seven of cups. You know, not all of those cups are for you. Five of swords. So yeah, there's there's competition. It's not going to give up and try to stop leading you off course. There's a king of cups. <laughs> I just heard we three kings be stealing the gold. And <laughs> yeah, three kings. King of Swords, the King of Cups, and the King of Pentacles. And we'll leave it there. <laughs> Hopefully this helped you. I know this one was short. Um, Virgo. But definitely take a look at other placements. Okay, I don't know how fast I'm going to get all of these out, but these are the energies that um, are going on with this. August end, we're just ending Mercury retrograde too, so maybe some decisions need to be made at this time about letting go of past people, past situations, final big closings. Um, I knew I was gonna have an interruption too. All right, love and lights all of you, bye.